Also breaking tonight, Houston police tell us an officer shot and killed a serial robbery suspect who opened fire on officers. That suspect died on the scene. It happened along Brady Street in East Houston. Stephen Gowen joins us with the new information we've learned tonight. Stephen. Mia, right here behind me, this is one of the businesses police say was held up at gunpoint today. The suspect, a Hispanic male in his late 20s to early 30s, and police, and police say this was not the first time he'd been in this area carrying out a robbery. In home security video obtained by KHOU, you can hear the gunfire as an HPD officer shot and killed a man tonight. The suspect, police say, was a wanted serial robber. The most recent robbery? just hours ago. To my surprise, he came to the corner, he came behind the counter and he showed us his gun. And Matty Garza describing the robbery at Magnolia's Ice Cream in the second ward. My concern was just the safety of my employees and the people that were around me, if there were any customers inside either too. Just minutes before, police say the suspect hit a nearby insurance agency. They say he got away on a scooter with cash from both businesses. The officers in the area have been looking for this individual because apparently there's been three or four other robberies in this area with the same suspect description. Police looking for the suspect spotted him a short time later near Eastwood and Brady. They gave chase. That's when police say the man pulled a gun and opened fire. The suspect produced a firearm and then ultimately started firing at our officer. Our officer returned fire and the suspect uh, went down behind us. The suspect killed in the exchange. The officer who fired at him, a 30-year HPD veteran, according to police. And that officer is now on administrative leave pending an investigation. The employees here, they closed up early for the night, clearly shaken, but fortunately, okay. Live in Houston, 2nd Ward, Stephen Gowen, KHOU, 11 News.